morning guys i am in my car it's raining really bad outside it just sounds so so peaceful but anyways that's not why i started filming so it is currently monday february 14th aka valentine's day aka day of love aka reminding yourself that you're single aka also the day before my sister's birthday happy birthday Kaylin. so last year was my first valentine's day alone in like a really long time and when i knew the day was coming i just kind of ignored it i think it was a monday or a sunday or something but i just was like nope it's non-existent to me whatever i'm single i'm just gonna forget it's there i kind of realized when you're single you just like don't do things or at least i don't because I'm just kind of embarrassed to do certain things that are kind of reserved for when you're in a relationship or you're with a friend. Movies or arcades. But at the same time, am I just gonna wait for someone to take me on a date? Am I gonna wait until I actually have friends and I can go out to these places? No, this is not a dress rehearsal. My life is right now, it's not in the future, and if I just sit around and I wait, I'm never gonna live my life. I really wanna make this video so that if any of you ladies or gentlemen feel like this too, then it gives you some inspiration to take yourself on a date because we deserve it, okay? We deserve it. So I dressed up nice today-ish. I look angry, my eyebrows look really angry. Today, I've actually driven out <laughs> I've actually driven an hour before I filmed my intro because for my first self-care I am going to Tim Hortons bitch look at that is that a thunderstorm did it just thunderstorm outside uh-uh no thank you but yeah look look at that that is the most beautiful thing I ever did see. It just, it, it feels like I'm in Canada right now. Hi, welcome to Please take your order. Hi, can I just take one second, please? Get a raise. Thank you. Hello? Where's your order? Could I please get a large French vanilla, please? Thank you. And uh, what kind of bagels do you guys have? I said please way too many times, didn't I? <laughs> I literally said please, like, can I please get a Tim Hortons French vanilla, please? Oh my gosh. Thank you. Right, you too. I'm so f***ing excited. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm in heaven. So yeah, today I'm just gonna be doing things that would be like my ideal date. So the first one, which might not be a surprise to people, is I love going to the zoo. I know zoos are a little bit controversial, but there's a zoo that's like really, really good near Manchester. So I was gonna go there originally, but when I was pre-booking the tickets, I said the reptile exhibit was closed off, and I was like, uh-uh. Is there any point to go if I can't see reptiles? No. So I decided to go to the aquarium instead and I'm so glad because I don't, I would not want to be outside right now. Uh uh. I'm actually going to be driving about an hour to this town called Hull. I've never been there before, but they have an aquarium there that is like one of the best apparently in the UK. So, non profit, they're a conservation facility. So, when you buy a ticket, the government pitches in extra money to like help with their research projects. So I'm really, really excited for today. I think it's going to be really cool. Hey guys, so I just got to the aquarium. We're going in. This is it, it's called The Deep. You look at me like I'm crazy When I shut my feelings out You look at me like I'm different Still you stay cause you feel something real Get so lost in my moments Doesn't mean I don't need you I, I, With your colors They kind of tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are and There's a lot of fish back here We fly around like paper planes They never know where we will Okay, I don't know if you guys can hear me But I am like I think I'm halfway through this exhibit And 
it's just like so relaxing. Look at these like displays. What's really nice too is because everyone is so preoccupied with themselves, like no one even knows or like cares that someone's vlogging or someone by themselves, you know? So it feels like really comfortable. Nobody can see it still they wanna tear us apart. There's something different about the way we are. Sorry guys, I would talk more, but it's actually really loud in here. I think this is the reptile section. My favorite part. After cup after cup, yeah, it's just the way we do it. Anything just to block out the real life, real life. Yeah, we love in the way they add some water, and we're going to the observatory. This is the cutest water I've ever seen. Call me crazy, but I think I might actually buy this. It's a tea, what is it? A tree frog shaped mug. Look at that. I don't know. It's so ugly, but I like it. Maybe not. Oh my gosh. Is that the Golden Gate Bridge? That's what it looks like. So I just finished the aquarium and I'm feeling pretty tired. <laughs> I have only eaten that bagel all day today. Yeah, I actually really enjoyed that. I really thought that I was gonna feel really uncomfortable walking around because you know when you're on your own like to the aquarium, it's, it seems like it's gonna be weird, but it's literally just a bunch of families and like no one even looked at me. The only time people looked at me was when I would stop and like try to take pictures of myself because then it was obvious <laughs> it was on my own. Yeah, it was really nice. That was like really calming, really relaxing. I really enjoyed it. It was like, I just sat there for a good 10-20 minutes just staring at the sharks and it was so nice. I loved it. You guys should seriously, like, if you are close to an aquarium and you don't have anything to do and you're scared, go. And if you're from the UK, go here. So now I'm gonna go to the movie theater. That's gonna be interesting because I don't really like doing those things on my own but we're gonna do it. Oh wait, actually no, I take that back. There was this one point, this group of guys like looked over and they just like were talking to each other and then they started to laugh and I was like, oh. So I don't know what they were saying, but to be honest, if it was Valentine's Day and I saw someone dressed up on her own, I'd probably be like, she got stood the f up. <laughs> probably does look like I got stood up. Like I'm just walking around so dressed up wearing like my heels. Oh, I didn't even show you guys what I was wearing. So I'm wearing this cute little lace top and then I have like these pleather pants and then I have these little tiny heels. Yeah, I'm feeling really good, really relaxed. I don't know if it was worth driving like an hour and a half to get here, but it's all good. I am now at the movie theater. Dinner, did you say? Of course. <gasps> oh my gosh, I've almost run out of peanut butter. No. It's okay, we'll, we'll make do with what we got. Well, this isn't how I planned it to go at all. This is... <laughs> This is even worse than what I was expecting. One for me, and one for you. So I'm having some peanut butter on toast. I was expecting to make like a really extravagant dinner and have this really cute and have like a candlelit dinner. I mean, we are having a candlelit dinner, but it's currently 10, 11, and I'm really tired 
and I'm not very hungry because I ate like a whole bag of popcorn but I'm gonna still have this dinner with you guys and talk first let's have a glass of vodka wow I'm not, I'm not even gonna try to make a joke right now I'm so tired bon appetit My final thoughts on today. I feel like I had a really good day and I actually really enjoyed myself. Minus the movie theater. The movie theater, I'm not gonna lie, was really awkward. I know people don't care, no one's even looking at you, but like, it's so obvious that you're by yourself when you're literally sitting by yourself, you know, like you kind of space out from people because they're like in their groups and you don't want to be by them because of COVID and also because it's just weird to sit next to someone, you know. I was really nervous today and I was even nervous vlogging, like, you know, it's, it's okay to be by yourself, but then like add vlogging on top of that and you're literally asking people to stare at you, you know? I want to make sure that like before I'm ever in a relationship again, like I'm a whole person with her own likes, dislikes, knows what she wants, knows what she likes to do. Um, I'm not being passive or like letting people choose things for me because I feel like a lot of the times like I'll just go along with the flow because I'm pretty easy going, but I feel like I can be a little too easy going sometimes. My battery just died, so I'm just gonna end it on here. I'm gonna make sure I have this so it seems like a vibe. So that is my video for this week. It was like a little bit different than normal, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope it wasn't boring. I feel like I didn't really vlog a lot in the movie theater because it was really, really, really embarrassing. Yeah, I'm gonna go to bed. I'm gonna quickly finish my peanut butter toast. But anyways, um, I hope you guys got inspiration from this video. I hope you, even if you didn't, you enjoyed going on a date with me. Yeah, I love you guys so much. And I will see you next Thursday for another video. Bye!